Hi there, Cappens. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Uh, right, yes, yeah, so um, I've had an Orc Smasher arrive, which is going on to my fleet, which is currently on the painting desk, and I'm really enjoying painting them. And it's just um, Rob's got the Abbess for the, um, what are they called? The holier than thou ones. Anyway, and uh, basically Rob's got um, a fleet he's making up the uh, the good guys, as we'll call them, and I'm going to crash into them and smash them to bits. We're no better than an orc smasher, so it's just come on to taking the cellophane off. Let's uh, pop it open and have a look, see what we get. So, this came as well in a day in the current climate, so very impressed. Okay, so there's the, the model. It's base, so it's obviously, it's obviously a big lad. Um... Like that. Here we go, let's have a look at the card. I'm getting a little bit better at this now, so it's 60 points. 74 damage points, 7 combat ability, movement of 4. And it's large, obviously, and it's Hawks. <laughs> Hawks is best. Um, we've got a red turning angle, uh, 3 heavy, 2 gun heavy at the front, light at the back. Um, yeah, as you'd imagine, it's going to be Ram 3. Okay. <laughs> Basically, the arts just just crash into things and kill them, don't they? Says the card. Yeah, cool. Really, uh, adding it. it's going to be obviously a flagship until the Hulk comes out. So, yeah, there's those bits there. Let's put them to the side. Let's have a look at the model. Clunk. Oh, that's a piece of resin and half, isn't it? Okay, so. Let's have a look. So the body is in four components. Okay, so. So that's the back. Again, the, the detail on these is really nice. Manti have done such a good job on them. That is a bit of a big boy, isn't it? So that's the main hull. Just break that bit off, it's the... Cast pounds give you an idea. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's a uh, a rather large ship, isn't it? As you can imagine. So just carefully try and snap these off. The off cuts, aren't they? So it won't sit flat. Obviously, I've not cleaned it up. But uh, just give you an idea. There we go. That is a. Uh, yeah, that is a substantial ship, isn't it? There's the top there. Wow. Okay, cool. So the, the hull and three sails. So it's got three sails on the actual thing. So I think that is the front of the sail. So it's sort of like there. Again, all the details are cast onto it. And then we've got two series of back sails as well, which is cool. Yeah, very cool, very impressed, as always. So the, the Mantix resins are really nice, really, really nice. They've done a really good job on them. And, uh, you know, just to get that detail in there and to actually, it doesn't even look like there's a great deal of casting issues involved there. Um, yeah, very happy. Let's look at the masts. Do we have a flop? <laughs> Here we go. Oh, they're pretty straight. Look at that. Wow. They're pretty straight, aren't they? Cool. There's uh, masts. I um, don't know how many masts this thing has, but we'll find that out, eh? So I think it'll have two and the various gun decks on the sides. Cool. Yeah, very impressed. Um, beast. That'll be my flagship for now. So, quite interesting. I don't quite know how it goes together as of yet. Um, it seems to have two mass pals, doesn't it? But yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. So there we go. So one orc smasher. Really happy to uh, to add that to the fleet. I'm not sure Rob will be too happy about it, <laughs> but we'll see. So yeah, there we go, guys. So more Kings of War Armada coming soon. And uh, do please uh, remember to subscribe. It does uh, mean an awful lot to me and helps me. Uh, I don't I don't make anything from doing this. I do it for fun, um, and it's just nice to have a back and forth. And let me know how you are, you are doing your fleet. I'm just my idea with the orcs is just to charge forward and smash everything but you know <laughs> let's see so thanks for watching guys as always uh, do please uh, like comment and subscribe and uh, as always wherever you are in the world stay safe and happy hobbying